Okay, so let's say that I have this video, this animated logo that I created um, using keyframes and motion tweens. And now I'm just trying to figure out how do I now go about making it stop? Because we see that when we actually take um, our, our movies in Flash that we create and we test them, we export them as SWF files. I can see that this just keeps playing again and again and again and again. So I can slow it down a couple of different ways. Maybe I want to slow it down and I want to add a stop. All right, so this is what I would do. Okay, if I wanted to slow it down, I could do one of two things. Okay, I could uh, come to the bottom of my timeline and I could lower the speed. Right now it's 24 frames per second. So I could put this down to 10. And let's see what this looks like. Hold on, let me double click at 11. We'll go to 10. And now we'll, we'll test it again. I can come and I'm going to come on in here, come to control, and I am going to test my movie and take a look. I'm going to see that it's going to move much slower. Okay, there might be some things that as I look at this, I want to change around. Okay, now let's take a look at another way that we can make it move a little bit slower. If I take this and I bring my frames per second back up to 24, which is the standard, I could also insert more frames. Okay, so what else I could do to expand the time is I could select all of these different frames. I'm just shift clicking and selecting them all. And then if I just come on up to insert and say insert timeline, frame this will just double the time that it takes for this little animation to take place so let's take a look on the controller we'll just watch it that way and we can see it's happening over a slower amount of time but again when i come to control and i test the movie i export it once again as an fw swf file it's moving slower, but it's going over and over and over again. Now, if I wanted to just do this one time, what I would need to do is I would need to insert a stop. A stop is created through action script. So the first thing that I need to do is I need to create a new layer. I need to create a new layer, and I'm going to name this layer action. My actions layer. This is where all of my actions are going to take place. Now, in order to insert a stop, I am going to I need to insert it inside of a keyframe. So right now I am in frame 48, and I can tell that that's where I am because I come on down to the bottom of my timeline and I see the number 48. Okay, so, but again, it needs to be inserted within a keyframe. So what we want to do is we want to come on up to insert timeline and we want to insert a keyframe. And now what I'm going to do as we come to that keyframe is I'm going to insert a stop. So in order to do so, I go to my window. I open my actions panel. It's within my actions panel where all of my action script takes place. Now, when you come into your actions panel, again, your actions panel may look like this, but let's just minimize that. Don't worry so much about what's over there. And if you're working in Flash CS4 or below, what you would do is you would actually write, the, write it right in here. Now, if you were working in Flash CS5, you could go into Code Snippets and you could come to here and you could hit double click stop at this frame and you would get the same code. So let's take a look at how we would do it, how we would write this stop in on our own. We would just write stop, parentheses, parentheses, semicolon. Stop is the action script word. We can say it's action script vocabulary. Action script vocabulary is always in blue. And we have the semicolon. The semicolon in action script is like a period is to a sentence. So now let's test it. We'll come to file save and we will test we come to window control and again my keyboard it's always good to learn the keyboard shortcut for movies that would have been good if I did but we see we have our movie and it stops after it is done real quick if we wanted to well I think we'll leave it at that
there it is. We can stop our um, animation from happening. Thanks so much.